Brock Lesnar. He's back, guys. Fucking end of SummerSlam. Brock Lesnar, ponytail and all. Man bun. Makes his, uh, makes his return to the WWE. Um, I guess it was expecting Please something. The fans, not the money, yo. Yeah, at the end, man, he's celebrating. You but count your role. Hands up to the fans and he's deep down inside. He's thinking, I don't give a fuck about these idiots. I'm here for Vince's millions. I mean, that's that's really. I mean, I mean, Brock would rather be sitting in his fucking ranch at the moment, banging Sable. But he's thinking, you know what? Vince McMahon's desperate. He's seen CM Punk uh, debut on Rampage on it. He makes a, a late phone call to Lesnar. How quick can you get to Las Vegas? And Lesnar's like, "How much are you paying, son? <laughs> How much are you paying, bro?" Uh, one one private jet flown out to uh, Brock's ranch, and then Brock's here. Brock's here. SummerSlam. It is Brock Lesnar's now, this return. Was a pop. Compare it to Becky Lynch's. I mean, Jesus, need they give a shit about... This is the real man. This is the man. The, the beast. The monster. This is the guy that'll fucking end careers without even trying to. And uh, now he's back. I'm going to assume that he's going... St I mean, I'm going to assume he's going straight onto the SmackDown brand. Known WWE probably won't even be on SmackDown this week. <laughs> nah, I think he will. I, I think he will be on SmackDown this week for the simple reason is... Um, Punk's going to be on Dynamite on Wednesday. So you've got to assume that they're going to try and do something to counteract that on Friday. Aye, and then... The Plus there's Rampage on after Smackdown, so they need to, like... It's like a fucking chess game now. They're going to be thinking, oh, fuck, what's Punk going to say about us on Wednesday? Oh, we need no. we need to get the Beast on Friday. Um, assuming he's going to be on Friday. Anyway, he comes out. Massive evasion. Uh, gets in the ring. Stares down Roman Reigns. Paul Heyman's pissing his pants in the corner, fucking crying. No! No! Brock! Brock! Um, and then that's it. They have a bit of a stare down, and, and Roman Reigns shits himself, and he leaves. I'd have liked an F five or something. I, at least if they, if they didn't want to have contact here, could they not have had Cena getting back up, and then Lesnar just turns around and kills him? Then that that makes Cena's you know Cena can just leave. Yeah. No, could Cena yeah, not? I'd love a triple threat between these. Three. Could, could Cena not got? Uh, could Cena not got up like dazed and? No. Yeah, no, I agree. I um. Um, I just thought it looked a bit awkward after Roman Reigns left, fucking Lesnar's jumping about in the ring. No, but see, see right, it's, it's great Lesnar's back, you know, but we've seen this match a million fucking times. Like. Yeah, true, but we haven't seen it with Paul Heyman on Roman Reigns' this side. I don't know, but how much difference is it going to fucking be, like? That's true. Well, I hope they don't, I hope they don't be re fucking, I hope they don't just do a, a Heyman switch. Yeah, that would be pretty lame. That would be lame, wouldn't it? Because it would just be like, what's the fucking point? It would be like, sick, you're just going back five years, six years. I mean, well, less than that, but yeah, I get your yeah, point. I know, but I would say, I, no, I would say it's different because I think in the previous matches it's kind of just been Rock Lesnar's battered this guy, even though Roman Reigns won one of them or yeah. two of them. Whereas I think in recent years Brock Lesnar's shown he's been beat. Well, he has been beat. I mean, he's been beat by Drew, he's been beat by Seth, and now Roman Reigns is like the the top so, boy. Yeah, so I wouldn't be boy. surprised even if the psychology and the, the the match and all that stuff's different. But here, Brock Lesnar's back. Uh the paper few. We'll dare, we'll dare review, but all, all I'll say is, it wasn't the greatest pay per view, but I guess towards the end it picked up, and then see, seeing Lesnar coming back right at the end was uh, was a bonus. Would have been nice to have seen him get a bit physical, give us something to go off the air with, but nah, didn't they happen? We have to, I guess, we didn't pay. It was, it was just a free pay per view, you know what I mean? We're not paying for this shit, so. Well, well, I mean, well $9.99 a month, but here, that's, that's peanuts. Chump change. Anyway, guys, till next time, Brock Lesnar's back. Peace.